Six years after beginning to use curricula based on the science of reading, Northridge Local School District is seeing impressive growth in its youngest students' reading scores. Higher percentages of children are reading on grade level, and administrators and teachers are asking themselves, why didn't we move to science of reading sooner? We had a majority of our students reading below proficient. We were meeting the needs of probably 30-40% of our kids and then the other 60% were struggling. We're in year two of full implementation and that implementation is at the K-5 level. We've had a majority of our students move from either below grade level or extremely below grade level to on grade level or even excelling past that. So when I look at where our kids were reading three years ago compared to where they're reading now at the end of kindergarten, it is tremendous. Currently they're decoding all but tricky words in a sentence. We talk about Romans in our curriculum in third grade and they're relaying that back to the Greeks that they learned about in second grade. Teachers, they struggled with that. They didn't think that, that kids should be learning Greek culture in, in second grade or Mesopotamian culture in first grade, Shakespeare in fifth grade, the data kills denial. There were two of us on the selection committee for kindergarten. We were the holdouts. I, we thought this is too much for our students and I remember sitting within the first couple weeks and I said to our um, literacy coach, I said, this is too much and she, she reminded me, remember the knowledge component is two years above where your students are academically. It is to provide comprehension above their level and get them talking and discussing. I was the first one to say we were wrong. So we have 60 minutes set aside for skills, so the decoding, the word recognition side of the simple view of reading, and then there's another 60 minutes that is the knowledge side. This is my first year using Amplify, but so far I've absolutely loved it. They give us the groundwork to use, but then I can kind of mold it and be flexible in the way that I present the knowledge to the students. We can tell you exactly how a kid is doing in reading, and not just 20 kids, every kid, all 702 of them. Every teacher in the building is using this curriculum, so we all are on the same page with everything that we are doing. I know that my data, my results, my students' growth is from this curriculum, from using the science of reading. We know that there's a lot of coaching and feedback that needs to happen continuously to hold all of us accountable. You don't just train one day and then you hope everybody picks it up. You train, you coach, you review, you revisit, you look at data, you look at the adult data, you look at the student data. You, you do that continuously and there's never that point where you're like, okay, good, we're done. Fidelity checks were not about catching you doing it wrong. It was simply about catching you doing the practice as best you could and then us coming alongside you to support and encourage you and coach you up. The training was intensive. The first year was a lot of work. This year has definitely gotten easier. I think what Northridge got right in implementing Science of Reading was it was a non-negotiable. We all had to go through the letters training. Any new teacher that comes into our district, that is a requirement. I feel like you could walk into my room and see my kids engaged in whatever is happening. Whether that is we're learning about the human body, learning about space, learning about Romans or Vikings. Every single subject matter that we have tackled, they love more than the last one. And even my lowest readers are part of the conversation. It was hard because people were used to just give me the times of my specials and my lunch and then I build my day. I think teachers felt invaded because we were coming in and it was the sense that, you know, they're 20 year teachers, they're 25 year teachers and you're coming in to tell me what to do. I've been doing this a long time. Teachers essentially have become like new teachers again, learning how to teach differently, how to use a, a new curriculum differently and it's a three to five year process minimum. If anybody believes they're going to pick up the science of reading training this summer, and see just incredible growth and change next fall, that, that's probably not an accurate thought. I am, will be the first person to tell you 100% that it's the best thing that I've ever taught. So I think, why didn't we start this sooner? <laughs>